Hi, I'm Michael Naparelski, Strength and Conditioning Coach here at the U.S. Ski and Snowboard Association in Park City, Utah. Today we're here at the Center of Excellence to work with Greta Eliasson, free skier, and show you guys some exercises you can do during the ski season to help stay in shape. I'm here to show you a couple exercises you can do at home or at the gym from beginning of the season to the middle of the season to the end. Hope you like them and good luck. So to maintain balance with the upper body strength and pushing, we also include a lot of pulling exercises, especially in season. With any pulling exercises and chin-ups, it's important to squeeze your shoulder blades together, pull your chin all the way up over the bar, and lower down slowly. This exercise is the single leg Romanian deadlift, or single leg RDL. It's an exceptionally important exercise to develop strength in the posterior chain and hamstrings while also challenging hip strength and balance. So this is a variation on a lot of what most people have done because it's a single leg exercise. And hamstring strength is exceptionally important for, for hip stability and trying to prevent ACL injuries. Greta's gonna keep her, her plant leg bent and she's going to push her heel backwards which actually pushes her whole body forward. So it's important not to lock out your knee it's important to go slow because these, this exercise also leads to quite a bit of soreness. This exercise is called the Swiss Ball Trifecta. It's a complex of three exercises designed to strengthen the posterior chain, the glutes and the hamstrings, and also the core and low back. So we're actually trying to light Greta's hamstrings on fire with this exercise. She's going to do five reps of straight leg hip lift, five reps of bent knee hip lift, and then five reps of bridging leg curl. So the entire time we're working on hip extension and also knee flexion, really challenging the glutes and hamstrings, and I promise you will feel the burn. Yeah.